Like other online translation tools, Google Translate isn't perfect. It does have a good reputation for accuracy, but it does make mistakes. So use it with caution. It should work fine with casual browsing of websites for example, if you just want to see what a website looks like in Chinese, but be very careful in relying on Google Translate for anything official. But Google Translate becomes very useful for simple translations like reading and replying to comments on YouTube videos. Welcome to Newbie Computers Channel. And if you spend a lot of time on YouTube, and you want to interact with other viewers, maybe you will come across some comments in various foreign languages and you don't understand what they mean. Of course you can translate it with Google Translate, but it's done manually and you'll probably get tired every time you do it. Or you can also translate the entire YouTube page, but this is not fun because you can't see the original comments of each audience who have various languages, you also can't respect and appreciate them by replying or commenting in their native language because it's already done translated. In this video I will give a solution, I have made a Chrome extension that will bring up the translate button in every comment from the viewer, and when you want to reply you can also directly translate it according to their language. This method still uses Google Translate, it's just that it's easier and you don't have to worry about changing pages from YouTube to Google Translate every time you want to read or comment. You can use it for free, if you like it I hope you are willing to subscribe to my channel and like this video. After you install and activate this extension, you have to refresh the page from YouTube and Google Translate for the extension to work properly. Please remember, make sure you don't close the Google Translate page, this extension needs it to work. When you read the comments, a translate button will appear on each comment. Click the button to translate the comment into your language. Wait a while until Google Translate finishes translating it. You can choose your language by selecting it on the extension pop-up page. If there is an error message, you can try again, if it still occurs, try translating the other comments first, it will solve the problem. Reply to comments in the original language of the comment, you must first translate the comment so that the language can be detected, after that you can reply to the comment in any language, press the translate button and your answer will automatically be translated into their language. This also applies if you want your own comments on the video, select one of the comments that matches the language you want, then translate it first so that the language can be detected.
This script can work in various languages and various browsers such as Chrome, Edge and Opera. In each process of translating, there is a delay of 3 seconds to give Google Translate time to finish doing it. If you feel it is not fast enough, you can change it in the translate.js script in the translate underscore time underscore out constant. Make sure you reload the extension on the extension page, reload the YouTube page and reload the Google Translate page every time you change the script. After you download it, extract and load it into Chrome, Edge or Opera browser. I will use Chrome as EN example. Go to Chrome extensions in your browser. Ensure that the developer mode checkbox in the top right hand. Click load unpacked extension to pop up a file selection dialog and select your directory. If the extension is valid, it'll be loaded up and active right away. Ensure that the enabled box next to your Chrome extension is checked.